Hey guys, welcome to Hampshire UK Yellowbird Part 2. This is uh, 6 uh, to 10. So, your first one, number 6, is UK Cars times 5 Super Air Performance times 4. Uh, so, I have gone with uh, obviously a selection of UK cars. Um, so, the Jaguar at 323. And then the Lotus is also 323. Three. I've tried to use cars that everyone will have, but you do need to use super rares. So I hope that you guys have got them sort of maxed. The Insignia is also 323. Three. And obviously using that because of the standard tyres. Uh, then this Lotus is also 323. Three. And then finally, the Jaguar at 332. And that will get round 6 done for you. So into round 7. So UK cars times 5 with super rare performance times 5. So I've gone with the same two cars as the first two races. Uh, sorry, the first race and the last race. Um, being that theirs aren't fully upgraded. So 323 on the MG. And then the same insignia as before at 323. Same Jaguar. Three three two uh, same lotus at three two three and then using the focus super chips also at three two three so that will get you around seven box off pretty swiftly as we fire into round eight and don't forget guys, if you do like my videos, don't forget to hit them like and subscribe buttons. UK times 5 with an ultra rare performance on this one. So, a full change of hand almost. So the Alan, you're starting with a 3-2-3 build. Then the ultra rare I am using is the Aston Martin. Uh, now mine is actually built 323, but I'd recommend probably a 332 on that because the handling isn't too high. Uh, and then same Lotus. In fact, no, this one is the 233 build. Uh, and then 323 on the Vauxhall. And then finally, a 332 build for the test bowl on the Bentley Mulsanne um, Grand Limousine. That's a pretty beasty car. So we'll head into round 9. And it is 5 UK cars with an ultra rare performance of 2. So for this one. You are going to either need for race 5 the same Caterham or you're going to need something with four wheel drive. So I have chosen the Sierra. So I'll just go through these builds with your 323 on the Mondeo, then 323 on the Jag, uh, 323 on the TVR. And that only just gets the win, but it's good to know. And then I'm on 323 on the Lotus. So you can use the same Caterham for race 5, or you could use the Escort Cosworth uh, at 323. 
and I've used the RS Cosworth here. This is also 323. I know a lot of people have moaned about this race. Uh, I don't know how many cars will win, but I certainly know that them three will win. And that will get you through that round. So into round 10. And round 10's requirements are UK cars times 5 with an ultra rare performance of 3. So I have gone Lotus crazy here. Um, I've used what I've got and I'm hoping that you guys might have the same sort of cars. Uh, but if you've got a TVR, I'm sure you'll get through that one pretty quick. 323 on that Lotus. Uh, this Lotus is actually built 323 as well. And there's plenty of RQ for you to play with. This is the 323 build on this Lotus too. Uh, 323 on this Lotus. So that's every Lotus at 323. And then finally 332 with the Aston Martin to save you a bit of RQ. And that will give you round 10 completed. And just a, a final word, um, if I can just have 15 seconds of your time. If you do fancy supporting me, you now can on patreon.com forward slash go away on gaming uh, without the hyphen. Very much appreciate any support you could give. Take care. Bye bye.